exactly. But not going to have the opportunity to do so here today. Yes. However, that does set up our grand finals. It is going to be Anakin, Red Bull Radiance Anakin, going up against Talon Esports Kokoma. This is a run back from the winner side of top eight when we started off here just a couple hours ago. Uh, Anakin took that set. I'm trying to remember the score. Was it two to one? Yes. I think it was. I believe yeah. it was two to one. Yeah, I think Kokoma got the first game and Anakin ran it back really strong the next two. So Anakin, you know, I think the history with Kokoma is that he has beaten Kokoma previously uh, in other tournaments, so he's very confident against him in general. But let's see, man. Kokoma, he's been getting better and better as well. But knowing the way Anakin is, I feel like he's very confident against everybody, but remember everybody, type exclamation joystick in the chat for the finest gaming peripherals from Kwamba USA. Of course. But oh, yeah, knowing the way Anakin is, I feel like just the way he goes in, he always believes he can beat anybody in the world. It doesn't matter oh, who yeah. it is. Uh, he, this is the best he's been, in, and you know he's he's fallen short to me a few times this year. Comma Breaker and Evo, of course, and that was just a couple months apart. So, you know he may have another opportunity here at the TWT Finals. You know at the finals, you know they've had that format where the players get to decide which group they want to be in. Do you think they're gonna? Do you think Anakin would put himself in the knee group, or does he try to avoid it? Okay, so the way I... I it's good that you asked me that, because I just recently read the rules about uh -huh. how the finals works. Okay. So, top three in points all get put into different groups oh, from the crap. start. Oh, crap. So Anakin's already separated from me. And then the fourth person is yeah. the LCQ winner. He gets put into their own group. What? And then at that point... Based on points is the order that people get to put, decide which group they're in. So Trust. 4 to 19, then get to decide which group they want to be in. Interesting. So assuming that Anakin... Actually, you know, if Anakin wins this, I'm not sure how his master points have shaken out. He might overtake Lohai. I think Lohai is second place. And, uh, you know, but either way, he's going to be in a completely separate group from me. So that scenario won't happen. Yeah, it definitely sounds like... He will, without a doubt, be separated from me. But here we go. This is the Grand Finals here at DreamHack Atlanta. Last event on the Tekken World Tour for 2019 before we go off to the finals and our LCQ. Going to go to Twilight Conflict number two. And it's going to be a straight run back of the characters Jack versus Paul. Yes, sir. We. And yeah, currently Anakin already in third place, so it's not going to shake things up at all. He's, he's definitely getting put into one of the groups away from me and Lohai. Um, okay. Fight. Yeah, and I think even if Kakoma manages to defeat uh, Anakin in this, he doesn't get enough points no to way. actually take Anakin's spot. I think he has 251 with that win on Friday, so he would get 230 from winning DreamHack, so that's not enough. No. Not even close. But here we go. Anakin right. looking Damn, great. so many pokes so fast. Yeah, Anakin's in a hurry. He's like, yo, man, it's ATL. It's my hometown. I want to win for the people here. I'm surprised that on that low parry, Kakoma didn't spend Rage Art right away yeah. to get max damage on that. But I mean, maybe Paul is still not his main character. You know, it's, it's, I think it's still Kazumi. Paul is just the secondary. He's been running a lot of And he's just doing a lot better in Season 3 because Season 3 Paul is something else. I talked to him yesterday when he made Top 8. He just came up to me. He looked, at, looked me in the eye. He's like, Paul's so strong. Yeah. I don't think any of us really expected Kakoma to be a Paul main, right? But if you go back to Dubai, he beat me with Paul. Yeah. He, did he get him? I think he did, yeah. Yeah, he cancels he's dead. it. If he hits the wall, he's dead. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Didn't he's even need dead. the ground hit. <laughs> Man, Paul is so dumb fun to watch. A little punish there, snap. So interesting to see Kakoma like sprinkle in these little panic moves every so often, like the sway one plus two, the the forward one plus four. Oh, oh. you know it's acting kind of crazy. Is, is it wasn't Paul considered the anti Akuma character before? Yes, yes, he was one of the first ones in arcade, right? In our when in FR when yeah. uh, Kuma first came out in arcade, right? And like Kuma didn't have a good point for death fist. Yes, but like Paul played don't even have to use death fist. <laughs> But here we go, Kakoma with the round count lead here in game one, grand finals. Mix of time. I mean, at the same time, you mentioned the Paul versus Akuma. For a while, when Geese first came out, a lot of people were picking Paul against Geese as well for the really? same reason. No punish on Death Fist. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, Sides to three, takes that final round. 
for Kakoma. He gets himself on the board. Remember, Kakoma being in the loser's bracket means he has to win two three out of five sets against Anakin in order to be our champion. And I think he wants it. He wants that W. Yes. Winning winning Atlanta Battle Opera on Friday and winning DreamHack in the same weekend would be such a huge confidence booster for him mm -hmm. going into finals. And But Anakin, you know, like winning DreamHack Atlanta, putting that nice little cap on such a strong season would be... Exactly. Yeah. Would be so sweet for him as well. Yeah, you know, he wants... I mean, he's a strong, strong contender to actually win the finals this year, despite his losses to me, right? And, I mean, he got smoked by Arson Ash, too. But I still feel like, you know, he's he's due. He's due for the win against me, you know? So it, it could just happen at the finals. Maybe. But Anakin with the interesting pick. I I don't know if he random this or he picked it on purpose. We're at Howard to stake mm -hmm. against Paul. Interesting selection. He was just Damn! standing there and still got hit with the Shredder kicks. Stare down the Shredders. This is it's not enough Rage to kill. Art? This can't be enough to kill. He's going to jump a kick, though. Ugh. Oh, what the, the hell? First <laughs> one whipped. Oh, I didn't get the full. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Jesus. He had two chances there. Two. Kakoma had two big chances there to get that round, but no. Anakin walks away with it. I thought he was going to death fist after that whip jackhammer. With Same. a wall splat. And then he ended up hitting a button with one. Koma. Little punish on the down four two. Yeah, you're right. He, he just throws out the one four one four. A lot of people aren't expecting it ever. Yeah. Throws out the shredder kicks. Like, this is so odd. It's so unusual for him. Yeah. Like I said, like I believe I said before, a little bit of like Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Hyde. Like, Kakoma getting angry, throwing out some more stuff, mm -hmm. subverting expectations. We saw that in the first set yes, as well. Sir, delayed down back two. And it's really, it's like, it's that concession of respect. I know you're smart enough to get out of this, so I'm just going to give the counter right away. And Anakin, a very nice down for two there. And this is exactly what happened in the first set, right? Kakoma wins the first game, kind of back and forth ish. And then all of a sudden, Anakin's like, hold on a second, I remember how to beat you. It feels like every time he eats that forward two, he tries to mash out that forward one plus four, and he gets, gets it this time. But Kakoma and Rage, Blue Death Fist gets spent. He beat. ran up for Demo Man and like, get away from me. 2-1. Yeah. I don't care what punch you hit me. I'm beat playing out, with you. Yeah, beat out the Demo Man startup. And gets that second game for himself. Now, does Kakoma rematch here? This is not a bad stage for Paul. But he's going to stage select. You know, at any point, they could have gone into that breakable wall. Kakoma could have thrown a Demo Man, broken that wall. Mm -hmm. He's thinking about it. Jungle Outpost 2. Do you think about switching characters? No. He considered it for a second, I think. No, I think he just pressed the wrong button. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Boy, he's that jittery, huh? He looks nervous. He wants to win. Yeah, I feel like, you know, like, even though I said that he had won a Masters event this year, I feel like a lot of Kakoma's uh, placings this year, you know, relatively strong, consistent placings, but I feel like, you know, like, a lot of the times during the tour, he would just be really strong early on and then maybe just kind of run out of gas like get like a like a seventh or a oh, fifth yeah. place at a masters instead or at a challenger event one he might also down be one two. of those players that after a loss he, he kind of shuts down a bit but definitely not today oh god <laughs> that was tight he sliced him to the forward forward two for paul spends it and you saw he blocked the 4-4-2-1, four, four, Anakin does a mid. In that situation, a couple of crazier Paul players might do an Iron Mountain, Mountain to try to challenge a jab. I so that's what it's coming. Yeah. It's like, let me just check this to make sure I don't die. Hey. Running two. Sidestep two. Sidestep two one. again. Back, Back two. two. All the twos. I wish I knew Jack move names. I mean, whatever. <laughs> it's going to be like... Big uppercut, robot arm. I really wish that was actually the case. Breaks the one plus two throw. <laughs> oh, deep debug. Not this time. Oh, maybe wow. this time. He was gonna do it again. Crowd goes wild. Anakin running away with the set. Get off me. Forward two counter at start of the round. Not the first time he's hit Kikoma with that. Shredder kick. Get out of here. Here's that optimal punish. Dog, Kikoma's falling apart. 
Slice at three, though. Rage Anakin, mode. Anakin checking with these lows. Four in a row. Let's go back forward. Just do it. No way. Anakin one game away from winning the tournament. Oh, he's putting away the mix box. Yeah, he's I don't gonna bet him. it all on Kazumi. I think it's a good choice. And you know, like the way Anakin played at the end of that round, he knew there was only there was maybe only two ways he loses that round, right? He gets counter hit by the sway four like you brought up. Right. Or he gets low parry. And he was like, you know what? I'm just gonna stay back here. I'm gonna let him do something punishable that yeah. I can punish with that while sending four. Yeah, because he had, I think he ran up there and I was thinking like, what's going on with the death fist? He's not going to death fist. He's going to die from like the forward two or something. I'm punished. Yeah. So he's like, all right, well, I'll go for a low poke. And Anakin's like, nope, I know those are coming. I'm just going to backdash, duck, block low. Smart stuff. To the king of Iron Anakin 2-1 in this grand final set. Mm -hmm. Jack set. We saw Kakoma putting away the mix box. Is it Kazumi time, though? It looks it's like Lil, Yeah, he's highlighting it. Hasn't locked it in yet, though. Deciding on outfits. Where are we going? Is this going to work out? He's betting his tournament life on it. Duomo the Serial. It's definitely a stage that Kakoma has picked a lot in the past, too. All right. Potentially the final game of the tournament. You see, you can, like, I feel like I can visibly see all that pressure on Kakoma's face. Like, he wants to win so bad. You know, he, yeah. he takes it so hard whenever he loses, even though he's finishing, like, top eight. Yeah, know? but on the other hand, you, like, you see that face on Anakin. He's so good at playing that stone face, the shadow of that Red Bull cap just hiding his eyes. <laughs> Trying I love to be that that's become his trademark look. We're going into this round two. This is what this is what Saint used to beat. I mean, this is what Kakoma used to beat Saint. He brought out the Kazumi at the point. end, and he ran through him. Though. It's not looking that way currently with Anakin. Yeah, but you know, even though they use the same character, I feel like Saint and Anakin are very different players. Uh -oh. But the beautiful whiff punch on the down back one. Can he do enough damage here if he reaches the wall? He reaches the, I think he's going to reach the wall, yes. But the combo's still not going to do enough, is it? Oh, my Barely God. Barely enough. If he loses now, no. Wow. Not the punish. What? A bet. I can't believe he bet the twin pistons there. Anakin clutching it out, or Kakoma dropping it, not sure. Either way you want to look at it, Anakin gets first round. Healthy, out of here. Yeah, low parry there. The crowd is starting to rally behind Anakin now. They're sensing the victory of the whole tournament. He's pressuring, knocking on the guard of Kakoma. Sometimes I wonder, like, I feel like Tekken has like an invisible guard bar. It's like, this mental energy when you uh -huh. do stuff like that. Power oh, crush! The first time we've seen it all day. Doesn't get a pick him up off the wall though. Rage mode now for Kakoma. Slow him out of the fly. Tournament point for Anakin. Nothing Kakoma is doing seems to be working. This time, dash for the flash punch combo. Anakin checking with the down back one. Or two, no punish. And he is chopping his ankles. Kakoma only has half life left. Even less now. All these incorrect responses to these blocked moves. Finally gets something going here with the down board one, two. And Say one, two as well. Running tackle. Blocks the punches though. Magic for Kakoma might not be done yet, but this combo is not gonna kill. Even if he reaches the wall, I don't think. Yeah, it's not even gonna reach the wall. Corners himself though. Uh oh. Oh, oh the the ball ball breaks the, the wall! Penalty. That is gonna be the tournament. Anakin wins Dream Mac Atlanta. What an end there. The perfect time to use that rage drive, getting the balcony break, dropping the A. Uh huh. ATL Anakin. Representing oh. Radiance, Red Bull, and Atlanta. Wins Dream Mac Atlanta here. The last match event of the Tekken World Tour for 2019. Congratulations. Top three in the entire TWT standings is Anakin. And with this win, I don't know where that bumps it. Might be top two now. Regardless, that's pretty darn high. Pretty see, darn high. And you see that sheepish grin on Kakoma's face. He's like, I got messed up. but I mean, he won the first game. Yeah. He was looking good. But here you see, this is the bracket. This is how things unfolded for our top eight here today. 
And Anakin, man, going undefeated in set throughout this entire tournament. You saw him 3 0 Spirogen in the winner's final, 3 0 Kakoma in the grand final. This man is on fire heading into the finals. Yeah, only dropping one game this entire top eight against.